In today's video, we plan and release our first console. Welcome back to Software Inc. and Studio XR. It is time to release the next generation of our RPG game series called Tower Wars. The second version is due to come out in less than a month. So let's fast forward to March and release this second version. Will it do us any good? Let's find out. And just like that, Tower Wars 2 makes us $4.7 million. Absolutely incredible. How much money do we make next month? This is going to be quite interesting. Yeah, we make about the same amount of money. That's actually pretty good. So now it is time to start working on some of our software. What we are doing, we've got Space Sim 6. No, we're not developing Space Sim 6. All right, Tower Wars 2 was just released. Battle Strike 3 is in development. All right, that's pretty good. So we need to do Space Sim 7 and Tower Wars 3 needs to go into development. So I'm going to do that right now. Very quick just like that the two games are now in development now and we just got to finish shop updating space sim 6 how wars we can cancel that we can probably just keep support on that that'll be all right can we do an update here we've got 300 that we can actually get done so tower wars 2 will go into update that wars 2 update is done that is good to see and i want to take a look at space sim 6 i might go for a porting job here and let's see where do we want to go we can go to these operating systems even these guys here would be all right so let's do that tower wars 2 let's also do another porting job there we can also we, oh, we can't go to all of them but we can go to at least three of them that would be all right let's go 10 10 10 make that a porting already and get that going but guys today i want to start something new and exciting so how are we going to do that i need a new office so let's come over here i'm thinking of building it over in this plot over here and in our last series of software ring we actually did we pretty much just copied someone else didn't we <laughs> We pretty much just copied someone else. I'm going to buy some of these blocks of land here, just like that. Go, go to Blueprints, and yep, yeah, well, as you can see, I've got Conflict Nerds Computer OS Development Office here. And you may be asking, Aiden, what are you planning on doing? Well, I will tell you guys very shortly. I'm just trying to figure out whereabouts I want to put this. Maybe on the edge here, something like that would be all right. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I'm actually quite happy with this. Let's add maybe some footpaths in here first. And then from there, we can go up to here. So that's got a footpath right around actually we might even go from here just like that that looks all right <laughs> okay so conflict nerd how is this office sorted you've got stairs you've got bathrooms okay and development spaces and what's up the top you've got air conditioning you have a kitchen a leader's office okay bit of a canteen area studio x oh, that's pretty cool all right so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna come to here i'm gonna go into furnishing and let's get these modern computers in here i think do i uh hmm do i want to just do the first floor or do the first we've got one two three three i've got three floors okay i think we might fit this whole building out with computers so guys give me a sec i'm actually gonna fit the computers out first then i'm gonna do the team that i want to do then we're gonna do something exciting so guys stay tuned make sure you guys also don't forget guys if you haven't already smash a like on the video and subscribe down below so you guys do not miss out on any new videos of software in hard mode but guys i'm gonna go through this very quickly so i don't bored you guys at home so guys this should be done like right now like i said it was gonna be super super quick all the computers are in the office if i go down one stage you can see computers are in and we've got two new teams one for the daytime one for the nighttime and it's going to be console and os so what does that mean i'm actually considering creating our own console operating system and a normal operating system but we're going to be hiring the best of the best in here as you can see we are hiring a lot of people and if we fast forward the game now as you can see we are loading out the office with new people which is going to be absolutely incredible but they won't be coming in until i believe the next day so that'll be all right we're slowly hiring we've got 33 on the count at the moment so let's just play the game like normal and create our first software so i want to do this i want to do a console operating system first i think that will be 
something really cool. Um, it depends what we want to do. I would like to do something XR, the XR Con. XR, maybe XR Con. E Station Connect. You know what would be cool to see? E Station or XR, XR Station. Oh, that actually looks really cool. So let's do this. We're going to make sure that this is going to be wireless communication. Maybe do a wireless communication system. System recovery, user account, unified search. We'll give maybe some themes as well, about a year. Wow, this is going to cost a lot of money. Let's go about $400. I think that'll be all right. So now we don't need to look at manufacturing at the moment, but we can at least go to design. We can create an old type of system. I think an old system would be actually not too bad. Uh, or do we want to go for a new type of console? What is it? 2012. It'd be best to go for something like this, wouldn't it? So let's go randoms. Let's see what we can find. Mm. So just go through some random designs here to see what we can find. Something that's maybe futuristic. Could be cool. That could be cool. Something like that. Nice big console. Something slim. I think I like this design here. And we'll just try and pick a random color maybe. Um, Primary color is going to be bottom. We could probably go for maybe a red. The top color can be probably be like um a blue. Like some type of blue. There you go. The Aiden plays colors. Look at that. And what about the middle? The middle. Do we do a white middle? Or do we go black? Black makes it pop, doesn't it? But you know what? We want this one to be a bit more lively, I think. And I think we might go for more of a lighter blue here. And in terms of the red, hmm, something like that. That looks all right. I'm actually digging this idea. Let's press OK. Can we do that? Do we do a controller? So I'm just rounding it off a little bit. And I might just straighten the width. Do I want to... Oh, I can have it nice and thick. I think something like that looks really, really cool. So let's go... We'll press OK on that. In terms of manufacturing, we can't do any remotes or anything just yet, but that's all right. It's going to be a new framework. We'll call this the X Station, XR Station. Ooh, add-on joystick. That would, a joystick add-on, that'd be pretty cool to look at. A super. <laughs> uh, what about um the XR Jewel? The XR Jewel. That looks, that sounds pretty um cool. Uh, what do you guys reckon? Comment below. So let's do hardware. Do we do wireless? Yes. Motion detection? Yes. Medium battery, large, big battery. <laughs> oh no. I think a small battery for our first um for our first thing. Let's do something small. Oh yes, it's now time to design the controller now. What are we going to do? Alright, we got some randoms here. Oh, that looks futuristic. You got that as a normal controller. That looks cool. I like that idea. Some random colors. Mm, go for you know what? Go for a white. Secondary, we go maybe for the blue and the back could be red like do it like a red that could be cool something different what type of style would we like though this third style here looks pretty cool so i think this type of remote is looking pretty good i like the idea of that so let's do that and we'll put that into development and next page what else do we need to do auto balance this out to 100 percent that looks pretty good i might actually get rid of themes can we still do 100 percent no we need themes okay let's do that next page let's see we've got the two teams on here we don't don't want these guys we want to make sure it's those guys there and instead of these guys we go to this guy there and what have we got 100 67 kendrick bonnet monarch you're looking like the best person for the job so let's do you we don't need a publisher it's going to take us two years to develop this software so we've got xr station and we have the joystick for xr station all right is the team coming in yeah, oh yes we do have a team we do have a team that's good to see all right well, let's making sure we're focusing a lot more on XR station. I might also go into here and see what we got going on in here. I might actually add, what do I want to add? I want to add maybe some inboxes. Does that help people around? I might add some calculators throughout the office. I think that'd be pretty cool to see. Yeah, just like that. I think that'd be all right. Now, in terms of our teams, have we got 60? As you can see, we're only halfway through hiring our teams out. So we're only halfway through. So that's not that great, is it? <laughs> Oh, no. It's still taking us time to get these people hired, aren't they? 45. Yeah, we're still taking time. It must be not, like, not many people available to be able to, like, in terms of our selection, we've got a strong selection of what we want. So it's taking a bit of time. So what I think we'll do is the Exxon Jewel Stick, let's push that into development. That's going to get done, which is really cool. We'll be able to review this very shortly. I want to get the console operating system out today. So it might take a little bit of time and a bit 
a bit of more elbow grease, but let's get this out the door. I think this is going to be really cool to see. Let's have a look at how this is going. A 9.9. .9. Look at that. Now, in terms of our teams, let's have a look. 53. We're getting there. Yeah, so the joystick is... The joystick is pretty much nearly finished. So we'll get some marketing done on that, uh, but we won't release that yet until the console operating system is there. So it's looking like our two teams are now fully hired now at 61 people, which is absolutely incredible. We're currently updating Tower Wars 2. The XR station is coming along nicely. It is going to take some time to get done, but that is all okay. In terms of... Okay, we're doing all right. How old is Aiden now? Aiden is 32 years... Oh, no, he's 52. Wow, okay. I think he retires at like 60 or 70 years old. Um, I'm pretty sure. So that's all right. We've still got some time, which is good to see. So the update for Tower Wars 2 is out. And let's also review Battle Strike 3 because that's coming along very nicely. We'll be able to release that very shortly. But in terms of our roles, I need to do some education for some of these guys here. So what does Aiden want? He wants us some service roles. So let's give him marketing. What do you want? Mm, let's make sure you've got multitasking on you. Then you want to be a developer. Okay, let's go developer. What do we want you to do? Some system. We can do some maybe system there as well. And maybe some 2D. That'll be alright. Multitasking, I want you to do. You also want to do some developing as well. So let's get you into 2D. And I want you to be a bit more social with the people. So looking like XR Station is now in progress now. And Strike 3 is 9.1. Let's alliterate that quickly and go into the next version. No, not next version. We're just going to keep smashing this out. Battle Strike 3 is a 9.6 review, so let's promote it. Let's get a press release going on here as well. We'll get that going. And let's maybe announce a release date for this. So March, what are we going to do? Mm, let's go maybe July. I think we'll go for a July release, 2013. So let's do that. We'll get this going. We'll release that. And Battle Strike 3 is around the corner from being released. And the XR Station, if we do a quick review on that, I think that is also doing very good and can be released by the end of the year. Yep, 9.2. We're nearly there. And just like that, XR Station is in bug phase now and it's time to release a press release for both of them. We're also going to make sure we're hyping both of them up too, which is bloody good. And just like that, Battle Strike 3 is only moments away from release with over 52,000 people following it and ready to go. Let's put that into development too. Space Sim 7. All right. Right, let's see and let's see what Battle Strike 3 can do. Let's release it. So the update for Battle Strike 3 is done. So we're gonna click finish and let's have a look. Oh, we didn't get enough marketing done. Oh no. All right, let's see what does Battle Strike 3 make us? 26 million dollars. Am I reading that right? 26 million dollars it made us. That's absolutely incredible. And we're only months away now from releasing our first. First console operating system. Wow, that 26 million. I, wow. Let's wait and see what's going to be next month. It'll be really cool to see. And I've also got a lot of porting going on too. So this is going to be interesting. 26 to 28. Jeez, I was spot on, was I? 28.8 million dollars. Wow. Alrighty. That's pretty cool. And we're only two months away now from releasing XR Station, the first console operating system. So let's fast forward the game and get this release. Hell, and that's another thing I wanted to say. Look at that. We are now worth, Studio XR is now worth $1.1 billion. We're doing absolutely incredible. I'm going to sell my shares in this company here. There we go. We are doing absolutely awesome. Let's buy up some of these guys here. I want to own a large chunk of this company. Of course, you know, why not? $39 million for Battle Strike 3 now. Whoa. $40 million for that. Wow, that is absolutely insane guys that is insane 46 million dollars for battle strike 3 guys whoa that is wow I, i've got no words to say i just don't know whoa all right well we can't buy any more shares in this company here what about this company here? can i buy more shares in here or no i can't I want to buy some more shares in the company. Let's see what is listed here. Dexware Interactive. 
Mm, you got 30%. Work digital. Let's buy you up. Let's see what you can do for me. Anyway, well, it is November, so let's release XR Station. How did we go? The XR Jewel released. Let's see. Oh, 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 that's pretty good. Five, that's good. Let's do a marketing budget of about $100,000. Let's order about, I don't know, 2 million copies. That'll be $20 million. Jeez. All right, XR Station is released now. How did XR Station go? Five. Ooh, four and two. Oh, jeez. All right, well, that's going to be $100,000 for that too. And we'll order about maybe 3 million copies. Jeez, oh, 500 million. Whoa. All right, 1 million copies then. Whoa, jeez, okay. Um, 100, oh, maybe, what about 500,000? 500, 1, 2, 3. Oh, jeez. <laughs> 200, 1, 2, 3, 200,000 dollars then. Well, 200,000. Jeez, update. All right, let's get this update done and see, does this make us any money? It's going to have to make money. It's going to need to make money, guys. The update is done for the station. Let's see now. How much does it make? This is going to be interesting. Um, hmm. Tower Wars 2, we might bring this down to about a $100,000 budget there. Space Sim 6, let's bring that back down to $100,000. So it is the morning. The XR station made $2.3 million. And is there any other issues? No. Uh, so it made 2.3 million XR station, which is good. The remote didn't do anything. <laughs> oh no. The joystick, how did that go in terms of marketing? In terms of, what about details? Zero units sold. Maybe. So we'll order more there. In terms of XR station, we can go to details here. We can see um, how many units we still have in stock. 8,000. So we probably have to. Can't, we can't put because it's operating system. So let's order some more copies. Alrighty. So it's looking like we are making some type of progress now. Now, XR Station making $1.6 million. The remote's making $300,000. That is absolutely incredible. We are now in development for the second generation of our console operating system, which is due to be released next video, which is absolutely incredible. And we've got, what, Tower Wars 3 also coming out beginning of next video too. Wow, it's looking like we're going to have loads of releases coming out very shortly. What's this? A 9.4. Let's go alliterate that. Wow, this is going to be so so, so cool. So we're pretty much going to be having loads of software coming out beginning of next video. So that means that is going to be it for today's video, guys. In the next video, we're going to be releasing Space Sim 7, Tower Wars 3, Battle Strike 4, XR Station version 2, and the version 2 of our joystick is also going to be pushed into development as well. We also got to make sure that our products that we've got in terms of we go to our operating system, in terms of the units that we have. Uh, let's go to here. Units sold in stock 200,000. We're just going to make sure we keep an eye on that. But what are we going to be doing in the next video, you may ask? Now, I've been planning out this series and I'm going to leave a pin comment down below because this, this week is just going to be softwareing. We're not starting in a new series as Christmas is around the corner and I'm also going to be taking off a few weeks from YouTube. But I think the plan is the plan is, I think we're going to build a factory next video. Uh, so so what we're going to be doing there is we're going to be building a nice big printing and manufacturing facility, a place where we can print our consoles, our remotes, and then also a place as well where we can actually do all of our printing, all of our software printing, which is going to be absolutely incredible. We are going to need a lot more money before we do anything like that. And I think we're, we're doing really well. We've got shares. The company is worth $1.1 billion. We're doing really well in, in terms of the shares. They are going up every single month which is absolutely incredible. I'm super happy, but I am going to run the game now, get this going, and so then we can release all these cool software at the beginning of the next video, which I'm super excited about. We're making millions of dollars every single month. And for you guys that may be questioning Aiden, you've made $40 million on Battle Strike 3. That's absolutely crazy, Aiden. Are you playing in hard mode? Yes, I am. Hard mode, there you go. It is hard mode. So for you guys that are questioning it, are you playing in hard mode? Yes, I am. Do you guys also want to see an impossible version of software rink maybe next year? Come down below. But next video, we're releasing all these softwares on the site here. You know what, guys? We're going to make millions of more dollars. And we just might be on the road.
to that two million billion, not two million, that two billion dollar mark, which is right around the corner. But this week's gonna be an absolute awesome week as we're gonna be playing Software Inc. all week. I can't wait. Guys, you got any thoughts and suggestions? Comment down below and smash a like and subscribe down below so not miss out when the next video goes live. Guys, I wish you enjoyed today's video. Smash a like on the video if you want to see more videos like this one. Make sure you click subscribe button right here. Thank you for watching this video. Click down here, watch the full playlist of Software Inc. Hard mode. Guys, I'll catch you all in Thursday's video at 12 a.m. Australian Eastern, guys. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys then.